Hello everyone, my name is Garrett O'Gamber, and I'm enduring the creepiest sunset of my life. Uh, in this game world. Come on, just die. Alright, this is 7 Days to Die, in case you did not know. You should have by now. I don't know why you're tuning in, if you don't. Um, however, if, you, if you've never heard of this game, you should really uh, take a look at it. It's a lot of fun. Anyhow, um... Last episode, uh, I discovered my save games are destroyed. They, they're kind of borked, so I'm doing this one last episode here for this playthrough before I get off, because when I get off, this will not uh, function. Uh, I will not be able to recover my save, so that's a problem. That is very beautiful and very creepy. Like, I've been stuck out here this entire time, walking, and I have not found... Okay, yeah, we're, we're still hunted. That's that's beautiful. Um, I have not found what I need, which is uh, food, a reliable source of food. I have food now from the deer I killed in the last episode, but that food it it makes me ill. So I need to find a place that I can shelter in, get some actual you know renewable food. This is not good. Renewable food would be, like, crops, and, you know, ultimately that's not going to happen anytime soon. I can tell you right now, unless I find a farm, I'm not going to be able to do that in the time given to me. Um, it is now twilight. Oh, God. And shortly night. And the zombies will have their ability to run now. So being detected is not something we want. Okay, well, that's beautiful. I hear a, a hornet. It won't matter if we try to stay stealthy. That thing will home in on us no matter what we do. Uh, I'm not eating that again. <laughs> you missed it in the last episode. I ate a uh, sham sandwich. As I was mentioning before, the next uh, update there'll be light sensors uh, into the game. Like, zombies will be able to see you via light. This has never been in the game before. A lot of people seem to think it is. It is not. Um, but it will be, hopefully, in Alpha 10. Um, I say hopefully because I think it's really cool that they're adding it in. They already added smell into the game. Like, there's that giant white nose over there on the corner of my screen letting me know that I stink because I've got meat on me. That's nice, big, burly venison steak. It's really shiny. It's like uh, made of copper or something. Um, I still haven't found a home yet. This is crazy. But yes, uh, zombies will be able to home in on you via scent. and uh, Via light, sorry. They can already do that with scent. Now, oh god, we found a neighborhood. Thank god. This is a terrible time to go, so I'm going to try to be stealthy about it. I've only got 16 shots. I could chop down... could chop down some trees from our wood. No, I've got wood. No, what I need is stone. I need stone. Oh, okay, okay. He's running around. He smells us, so he's gonna steadily make his way towards us. And there's very little we can do to stop him. Um, he's gonna home in, so... If I can grab some of these before he starts attacking me, at least I'll have some stone to make ammunition out of. I think he's been following me for a while, to be honest. Oh, shit. I can't see the mini-map. I don't see a smell radius, so I don't know... I don't know how much of a radius I'm giving off, but I'm definitely smelling bad. I'm not giving up my meat, though. We are so close to death before. Zombies can't swim anymore. They can walk. Unfortunately, this is not that kind of ground. Oh, 
Oh shit. This is not deep at all. So they're gonna be able to cross this as easily as I am. Okay, well, this will be a good place to... Oh! Oh, there is some deepness to it. This will be a good place to set up. Oh my god. Oh, they're making a lot of sounds. Okay, yep. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, no, no. Not good. Okay, not good, not good, please. Please, game. Please, game. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh, there are so many of them. I've probably seen a better chance of going in that building and fighting what's ever in there than out here. So we're gonna go in here. There's no door. That's, that's just great. gonna do here is put that torch right there so they can't walk up. At least they shouldn't be able to, but... <laughs> uh, this is actually a really good spot to be in uh, via uh, the uh, spider zombies, because they can't climb up past those ridges. Well, with this one. I don't know. Probably shouldn't tempt fate. So we should be fine here as long as there's no hornets. Um, and even they, you know, can be killed quite easily. We apparently have coal on us. I did not realize this. That's good. Means we have a good supply of torches. We did find some dog food, so we did complete one part of our mission. And I'm thinking now's the best time to make this a home. Uh, so we'll put the actual stuff there, because we have a good source of food around us here, as long as we apply ourselves and we look. It's a real shame that the moment I leave this game, though, this will no longer uh, exist. <laughs> I don't like this uh, save error. Kind of sucks. Um, we won this, but we will lose. There is, I think, a light beyond there. I don't know. Um, oh shit! Well, they got it. Apparently, that doesn't work anymore. So that's cool. Okay. I should look behind me, but I'm not. He's raping us. He's completely... He's gonna kill us. No. Oh my goodness. Okay, well, we just, uh... Oh, shit. We're dead. We're dead. Oh god, we're so dead. How we survived that. You gotta be shitting me. Well, it's morning at least, right? Oh, come on! Stop pathfinding, you jerks. Oh, God, I'm panicking. I shouldn't be panicking as much as I am, but I am. We're not getting off of here unless we deal with them. Oh, fuck you! <laughs> really? Really? And we're dead. There's, there's nothing I can do. Oh, 
she was a nurse. And unfortunately all she had was what I had, so... Um, it is morning now. It should be... Should be easier to get there. To get down, but... When they can just do that, that's not cool. Really? You never could jump up there before. Okay, well, we're royally fucked. Oh my god. We are royally fucked. Uh, there is not much I can do here. Yeah, there's a zombie right there. He doesn't see us. He's dead. We're not gonna overdose, so we can do that if we want. Um... Oh, shit. We may not have a choice. So, I'm actually gonna run down here. Oh, 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 oh goodness. No, stop, 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 stop. Bad zombie. Okay. Okay, we're outside. There's a zombie dog following us. And I got hit by some invisible zombie, which is perfectly acceptable, I guess. Ah, uh, that'd be a nice house to live in, but guess what? <laughs> Being chased. Oh! Thank God. Alright. We have a lot of zombies in this town. We gotta take care of them. It's been a rough night. I can't believe I'm still alive. <laughs> it's very hard to tell how you're swinging with this. Such a weird short animation. Mind your surroundings. Mind your surroundings. Always mind your surroundings. Best way to deal with the zombies is to back up practically every game out there. Stop it. Okay. That board is done. Oh, he had water on him. That's great. Ugh. Ugh. Just rifling through all the meat and nastiness. And they just keep spawning in. They claimed in the last update they also changed spawning once more, so they're not supposed to spawn in, but... I I'm seeing them do the same thing they've always done, which is just repeatedly spawn in. Ugh. Cat food isn't sitting well with us. That's no, okay, that's just the sound of my stomach. Hey buddy, what you doing in there? You doing some home improvement? You, you look you look really entertained. Oh, you're dead now. You're more dead than you were. And they're having a pool party down there. God, they've really wrecked this house. watching you pee. I can see your bathtub. Okay, well this is the exact setup I needed. Uh, I'm not seeing too much in the way of me. I guess some rabbit there, which is fine, but... I prefer finding some food that's canned. I'm gonna drop that and these. We don't need them. Um, I... Hey, fatty. You're a little too big to be in this pool. Stop it. Die. Whoa. Noggin's made of stone. I hate how they can stagger you. Okay, well, he fell down there. You got a bunch of flashlights on you. I don't know why you would need that many, but okay. Uh, there's something that was here, and it's not now, so cool. <laughs> I think it was the diving board. 
All right, we got this house to ourself. Um, there isn't a whole lot, though, in the kitchen. I was hoping for more. Honestly, one thing I can see that is edible is the uh, rabbit, but I can't... Ooh, no, that's cornmeal. Shit. I thought those were seeds for a moment, but they're not. Oh, we've got manuals, though. That's really cool. Um, I'm going to drop these. I'm going to drop that. Pick these up. Maybe I'll be able to make the claw hammer. Who knows? Uh, i got some tree seeds. I have some animal hides, which I can't actually use right now, so just put those away. Can I... Oh. Wow, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. It's fine. No, you know, I'm used to it. I'm an idiot. It, it, it happens. You, you play this game so long, and then you're like, Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Read that. Read that. And read that. I'm hoping there's a gun safe in here. But there probably won't be. That's right, there are gun safes in these kind of homes, but they're usually hidden already know that book, so we're just going to toss it on the floor, and it's going to do its little spooky spook thing right over there. Yeah, that zombie must have been so pissed off. It took out this uh, bed. <laughs> it took out the bed from underneath. Um, she was trying to free herself from the cabinet, but she wasn't quite hitting the cabinet. Uh, I love what they did with the doors. They're going to be improving the doors again in the next update, which will be pretty fascinating. Huh? Okay, that makes a lot of sense. I, my doors do that, too. Um, that is the gun safe right there, so we're going to have to go through that barrier. Barrier. Okay. Let's, um... <clears throat> plunk that down. There, no one's getting through that. <laughs> oh, it's going to take a while. Ah, to recharge my stamina there, drinking some water. It still takes a while, though. Even with the uh, iron axe, this can take a while. It's good that they're that durable, though. You know that they're going to last for a while. Okay, there we go. Um, got more of these. Sometimes I don't bother to read the title. I don't think it matters much, considering you're going to learn it. We're not going to make that into a ghost book. We're just going to put it down. We have one ghost haunting this house already. Hey! Cloth shoes! Yay. I always forget you can do that now. You can actually craft cloth clothing. There, yeah, we got some clothing. We're still topless and eyeless and then, uh, head <laughs> headless. That sounds really wrong. Um... But yay! We found the armory, and there's literally two bullets in a... <laughs> oh god, this is shit. Um, just gonna put that away. Uh, just gonna put that away, because we're not gonna be doing lengthy crafting. Oh, that's a pistol barrel. Okay. Wearing... <sighs> I'm just gonna put all the gun parts in there, because honestly... I will not have the time to make that. I'm going to put these flashlights on this. We're probably going to get some pool water here. Because, uh... It'd be nice to have it. If we can find ourselves a cooking pot or cooking grate. Mmm, murky water. Dead things. Delicious. They did a good job with the way the water looks now. It's very murky, very, you know... Apocalyptic in its appearance. Uh, we are going to put that in inventory so we don't accidentally drink it when we do not need to. How are we looking for ammo? Not very good, so. We're going to loot this other house here across the way, and we'll finish. Actually, I should probably finish looking at this place because there could be something in here. Other than zombies. I mean, there's always zombies in here. Hello? Oh, 
ko. Mahalo. Goodbye. Okay. Yeah, there you go. There you go. They were trying to get into this room. It's over here. Come on. Come on. Break it. You can break it. I believe in you. You know, it's funny. The zombies take down one panel and they leave the other one. It's just... It's disrespectful. They could have continued breaking the, the, you know, barrier down. Like, why not? I like this room. It's quite nice in here. Um... Uh, an Enforcer magazine. I think I'm done reading for today. Ooh, that's a lot of paper that we'll never get to use. We got some cloth stuff. Before I forget... Just because I can. How do I make a bed now? Come on, really? It's been a while. Did I just make it? I wasn't looking. It's fine. That is a airplane. Oh, okay, I was close. And that is a horde that I can hear. We're gonna have some visitors here in a second. Before we do anything stupid, we're going to go over to the window and investigate. Hello! That is a, a big bunch of zombies. Okay, that's not good. And they're heading directly for us, so we're going to go out the back. And what I said about tough decisions? This one's an easy one. Oh, there's no gun safe in there. I'd love to check that out, but... I don't think we have the luxury of doing that just now. Now they're gonna go in the building, I'm sure, and just be Oh, really? Really? Come on, really? How did you see me? That's so stupid. <laughs> that is unbelievably dumb. I don't- I don't even know. You should be attracted to the airplane! Come on, don't go for me. I'm, I'm no good for you. There's a thing there. I'd like to see what it is, but... I don't have the patience right now. I want to go in that building. See if there's any food. So they're going to attack the buildings here and there. We're just twitching, twitching away. We're watching the zombies go in. So that's going to be unsafe for now. Um, yeah, so, this is a creepy looking building. You couldn't pay me enough to go in a building like this in real life. <laughs> Start thinking there's things in the walls. Ooh, spooky. Oh, we found another glass jar. We honestly do not need it. A lot of this stuff we do not need. I just realized I do have a gun. This would probably make me feel a lot safer than crossbow. Only because I can repeatedly shoot it. Still love the crossbow, but... Hey! We got some food. Mmm, cat food. Oh, delicious. Such good. Oh, God! Oh, crap in my pants! That's what happens. But, you know, gotta live with it. Hey. Hey. Rolling in stuff. Not nearly enough, but we're doing it. Day by day. Get some more water. That's useful. It's a back door, which is good to know. This wouldn't be a very bad house at all to live in. This would be actually really, really good. Because um, there is a downs... No, there isn't. <laughs> you can make it down to this. But there is a back door that goes into absolute wilderness. There is, you know, the front door, obviously, which you probably wouldn't be using too much. And then you have an upstairs. Hey! We found a cooking pot. So we're just going to take that. We've got plenty of paper. You can break these, um... Rusty uh, kitchen sink cabinets for stuff. Got antibiotics, which is great. Um, I don't know why we didn't stack that earlier. We're apparently stupid. Okay, 
Everything's looking calmer out there. They have destroyed everything around here. Ideally, I like those bigger buildings better because they're more secure, but I've never seen this upstairs before. That's really cool. Um, I'm going to break this open. It's probably part of the new generation. Okay, we are now in. Oh boy, it's creepy. There are some windows here and there. Put that down. There is another room. There appears to be a corpse in there. So we're going to have to break this down. Again. <laughs> I like the layout of this building. It's very different. Uh, the you know downstairs is what you'd expect from the rest of the game, but this upstairs is vastly you know oriented very differently than the other buildings in the game. And I think that's cool that they're adding more unique buildings in. Uh, it makes the game world feel more alive because you know obviously an entire countryside is not going to look the same. It's not going to feel the same. There are subtle variances. Like where I live in real life, we have big homes and small homes, and there's homes that are just so unique looking, um, you won't find another for miles, if not another state away. And I guess they're trying to mimic that same feeling with this. There's another gun safe in here. Ultimately, it was not worth going into. If we had more time, yeah. Hey, look, there's an easy way of getting out. Um, this is a pretty good place to set up. Like, literally, this would be a fantastic spot to set up, as long as, you know, the zombies didn't try to jump, and they would, of course, but they didn't try to jump up here, we'd be fine, but I guess for now, the safest place would be that building, only because it has you know, roof axes, but at the same time, this could also be made into a secured fortress. However, I do not have the time for that. <laughs> Um, I'm going to end this episode here, and so with that goes this save, because, well, frankly, this game doesn't want to save for some reason. But I want to thank you guys so much for joining, and I want to thank you for the continued support. I've been getting more and more subscribers. In fact, this is the highest amount of subscribers I've gotten within such a short period of time. Like, literally, this has broken records on the channel, and I, it, you guys are just amazing. More people are showing up every day just to watch the videos or leave some helpful comments here and there and I'm hoping I'm I'm entertaining you because that's kind of the point here uh, I wouldn't really be doing anything else I don't want to do anything else other than make videos that you would enjoy and I'm gonna be doing more of this um, as the new updates come out it's just again I, I'll have to state what I've stated before is that I didn't want the content to feel Oh shit! I didn't. <laughs> I didn't want the content to feel shit. No, um, I did not want the content to feel stale. Okay, well that that's broken. <laughs> oh, oh, well, you know you could do that game and just make it impossible to do anything. Let's face it, like a man or a woman or a woman. Oh my god! Did we? Oh, we got somebody. Okay. Okay. Um, I wanted the content to feel, uh, you know, not stale. Like, it it would. It would feel stale if I continued to do this every single day, and that's why I've stopped making as many videos of Seven Days to Die as I have. Okay. <laughs> Fuck them. Um, I wanted to make more, and I still want to continue the series. In order to do that, though, I had to give myself some space from this. Otherwise, you know, I feel like too much of the same thing. Hey there, hi. Okay. So they're gonna try to come up those stairs again. And I can just jump down here. <laughs> Watch these ninja skills. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching, um, and I will see you guys in the next episode of Seven Days to Die.